Knight unveils the curtain of a historical event on April 14, 1865, at Ford's Theater in Washington, D.C., the atmosphere was tense with anticipation. Abraham Lincoln sat in the theater seat, savoring the play on stage. However, in an unknown dark corner, a shadow was being prepared that would change. History. The president's place acted like an ordinary night, but behind the scenes, silent threats were multiplying. Confederate sympathizer John Wilkes Booth approached the presidential box with determined steps. At this point, there should have been President Lincoln's guard, John F. Parker. Path. Due to a perceived lack of threat, this decision would transform the night forever. A gunshot echoed, causing sudden chaos and panic in the theater. A single bullet to Lincoln's head added another chapter to the pages, pages of history. While the audience remained in shock, Booth leaped from the president's box to the stage, shouting the word Six Semper Tyrannus, believing he had achieved victory against tyrants. Booth descended from the stage as the theater curtains concealed the traces of an assassination. Disappearing into the night, Booth escaped through a side door, blending into the darkness. This event was more than just a theater performance. It was a dark memory that left its mark on a period in history.